talking PGA Championship and who better to talk about it with than Dave Stockton, a two-time winner of the Wanamaker Trophy. Dave, how'd you get it done that very first time in 1970? I just finished reading the book, Psycho-Cybernetics, and I'd taken two, which is a difficult book, not fun to read, but I took two things. You had to be aggressive on the golf course, and you had to visualize yourself winning before you ever teed off which I played my practice round on, on Monday at Southern Hills and pretend as I came into 18 there were 40,000 people there watching me and congratulating me and sure enough on Sunday they were there. And I can remember on the fifth green, I three putted the fifth green and Arnold cut my lead to three. And the uh, guy yelled out of the gallery, you got him now Arnold. <laughs> and it made me mad and I actually I went birdie two, eagle two, double bogey five, birdie three. And I went to a seven shot lead with nine to play. And so there, and I had my adventures, which I usually do coming in, but I still made an intentional bogey and still won by two. But it was a, it was a great sensation. I felt sorry briefly for Arnold because that would have meant his grand slam, but it, it let me win my first PGA. And of course, the second one was a congressional in 76. And my first thought when I won made the 15, 16 foot putt to avoid going in a playoff with Floyd in January, which I desperately didn't want to do. Uh, that I was probably going to be a Ryder Cup captain someday. I'm with Davis Love the third, one of the past champions of the PGA Championship, and whenever I think of the time you won in 1997, I can't help but think of the rainbow that came out as you finished up on the 18th hole. What was that day like? Uh, incredible day. You know, uh, Justin Leonard had won the Open Championship, and I got to watch him win as a, as a friend and watch him receive the trophy, and then to play with him the last day. Um, to, to be ahead coming down the stretch where I had a comfortable you know last few holes where I knew I was going to win and then for the rainstorm and then the rainbow to come out and my whole family to be there and then Jim Nance to um, really call attention to my dad one more time you know uh, after he'd been gone for a while just everything it was a magical moment uh, as they say the script writers wouldn't have, wouldn't have written that it. it was so uh, so corny almost but it was a, a great finish for me and for my family. How did that week and winning the Wanamaker Trophy change your life? You're in a different club, you're in a different group, and your peers and the fans look at you differently when you're a major winner, and it really uh, gives you a lot of confidence.